Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Alexon and we're about to get destroyed because we don't have any water and that's the main reason from last episode I realized why we're dying here and that's because we have no water. We're dehydrated and I can't find anything around here for us to, to see if we can save our lives. Looks like it's not gonna happen. I, I'm, I'm literally looking right now, but if we die, it is what it is. Uh, we lived a good life. We can always use this kit again. Wait, is there anything in here? Oh, uh, no, there's nothing. That was it. Well, there goes our life. Let's just throw some flash grenades. Kind of see what we can do with this. And there we go. <laughs> what a way to die right there. Oh, wait, there's more. Wait, wait for it. And I, that was, no, never mind. Daisy in Minecraft. If you guys haven't already, make sure you guys hit that like button. Let's see if we can go for 100 likes. You guys really destroyed the like button last time and showed so much support. And it really does mean a lot, guys. I appreciate everything. The comments have been ridiculous. You guys have been leaving so many comments saying how much you guys really do enjoy this series. And it's something that you guys really like to watch. So, with that being said, if you guys want to see more of DayZ, all you got to do is just hit that like button. And more will be uploaded for you guys anytime you guys want. I mean, maybe not anytime. But you know what the deal is. Alright, let's see. We got some barricades. And we got some basic gear. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to select the kit. But this time, I don't think I want to use a slash kit, Alexon. I want to maybe change it up a bit and see what else we can find. Um, uh, let me just check out these chests here before anything. We have some gasoline, some fuel, and there's some more things down in here. So, uh, this is cool. This looks like a loading dock of some sorts. What is this, actually? Uh, this is a cinema, New Haven Cinema. So, we are in the New Haven section now. There is a map. If you do slash map, uh, they give you a link to a Google, Google Doc form of the map of this server. So, I'll post that up quickly for you guys to take a quick look and yeah it pretty much helps decide where we're gonna go so if you guys have an area that we want to explore in the next episode let me know in the comment sections and we will do that uh what i want to do oh brass knuckles oh that looks intense all right but i want to actually get rid of all this stuff and uh try out some kits that we have so let's give that a shot throw all of this out even though it would be awesome to have it but however we may not have space in the inventory even if we do um, you know, I just want to kind of start with a fresh, fresh thing. What is this here? This looks like an interesting box. Uh, so let's do slash kit and see what we can find here. We have, we still have Alexton. Uh, let's go for, uh, let's see what sounds interesting. Maybe we can go for hero. Slash kit hero. That kind of looks pretty cool. Or bandit or explorer. Uh, let's go with hero. Oh, that's actually kind of a small kit. So we can actually do a bit more. And we actually probably could have kept all that gear there. So let's do another kit. Let's do kit um, bandit as well. Maybe that can be kind of interesting. Um, did that not work? Let's try again. Kit. Uh, let's go with guardian actually instead. Guardian sounds pretty cool. There we go. So we have a landmine. Uh, we have a Mossberg, which is like a, a high-powered shotgun. We have a riot shield, and we have sh shotgun shells, which is really cool. Um, and that's an AK. So an AK with 35 bullets. A shotgun with this look this thing looks really awesome it has uh, how many bullets can we reload? Nope, so we have ten rounds with this uh, So that's pretty cool. We can try that out and then we have a riot shield which looks really cool like that's intense That's awesome right there. That looks awesome. All right, so that's cool We can just try these gears Let's actually go get the items we dropped just now because those are actually pretty decent items They have fuel they got all these other things that we need like a barricade and uh, Brass knuckles which are kind of cool. So let's organize this. Let's just put on some basic gear survival gear here. I guess um, This looks really 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 this is like a simple gear this looks like someone that's been surviving the apocalypse for such a long time. Look at that. It's not bad, though. Oh, there goes my... There we go. There we go. That was my sticky keys. Um, other than that, I think we have everything else we need. Barricades. Uh, potion of healing. We do need to find water because I don't want to end up in the same boat as last time. That was a horrible time for us. And what is this? This is rags. So we have rags for healing. Awesome. Uh, let's keep the, the uh, AK on the side and keep ourselves the Mossberg or the shotgun because that thing looks like it really can cause some damage if we see anyone. So what we're going to do is we're just going to explore around here, kind of see what else is going on. Um, and of course, in the future, I want to create a clan because as you can see, it is an option. There is an option to create a clan and I want to do that um, in the future and see what we can make. That should be pretty cool. Uh, barbed wire. I think we could still sneak up in here. Anything in here? Shotgun shells. More of that. I will take it. Um, M9, small caliber, uh, I guess we can take that, and it has the M9 ammo clips, so that should be pretty good. Barbed wire, we'll take everything we can, and also, uh, to actually answer one of the questions I had in the last episode, I actually figured out that, um, there are no backpacks, however, there are, uh, uh let me see what they're called, they're called safe storage, and that's actually, I believe, in the hub, or, like, the spawn area, there's a safe storage area that you can actually store your things, like a bank, which I realized, and it's actually pretty cool, so, in the future, next time, before we die, like we did today, maybe I'll store some items in there, just for backup purposes. 
purchases. Uh, what is this? This is a New Haven storage condos. This probably has some gear in here for sure. If it's a storage condo, there's got to be something like a bread roller. Why would I need a bread roller? I don't know. It says good for any angry chef. Oh, that's true, but I'm no, I'm no chef. I'm just a guy that, just a guy. <laughs> that's all I am. Surviving the apocalypse world. I'd probably be really bad at making my own food. Maybe like some, some, some quality pasta or some peanut butter and jelly. I don't know if I can find that stuff. I mean, who knows? Who knows? Man, this place is kind of empty. Um, okay, some more arrows, which are really important for us if we do find a makeshift splint, which could be really cool. Other than that, there's really not much items in here. I was expecting a lot more. Maybe the rooftop will have something extra for us. Uh, there is a chest. Maybe we get something lucky up here. Uh, just some more arrows and another angry chef bread roller. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Uh, we can actually get a good view from here. Uh, looking around, I see, oh, that's a parking lot, base, more apartments, uh, that looks like a cinema, which we just checked out, so we should head probably in this direction and see what else, that looks like a hospital, maybe not, uh, but we should definitely check out some of these places around here, and then this area looks kind of empty, oh, that's a food place, so food must mean there must be water, so we gotta go get that place. Uh, looted out ASAP because as you guys saw we died in the beginning of the episode because I didn't have any water Which is kind of funny because with all those supplies that we had in kit Alexson There was no water so we died from hydration. How sad is that guys? That's pretty sad. All right, so the food store is right here Hopefully we can find ourselves some water for emergencies now uh, I don't really know where to tell if I'm like dehydrated I don't know if there's an area that I have to see or I can't really tell but you guys let me know in the comment sections if you guys are aware of where to see that stuff. So next time, I kind of get a heads up before I just panic and find out that I'm dying because I don't have water. Uh, is there anything else around here? There's a lot of chests. Uh, there's a sleeping bag. Oh, that's cool. Um, jeans, we don't need that. More arrows and a P99. We can try that and see how that works for us, maybe. Uh, weapons are doing good. We have a lot of arrows now. Uh, a rock. Now, this landmine. I never tried it. I'm kind of really tempted to try that out. Oh, makeshift. Is this? Yeah, makeshift bow. Oh, there's. Why? That, that just lagged out. That was weird. Uh, there we go. So that works out pretty cool. Let's just take a test shot, maybe at one of the windows here. Oh, wait. What? It actually breaks the window. No way, that's awesome. All right, this server just keeps getting better and better. Um, all right, this looks like a little bar. Oh, I think we attracted a lot of walkers from that sound. All right, let's see. Oh, we can break it with a gun too. Okay, so that's cool. You can actually break glass, which is something that is really cool. Oh, let's see if we can take out this zombie with a makeshift bow. This looks pretty cool. Nice, nice, not bad. I really like the sound effects, uh, but I do not like the sound of these zombies. They are not so friendly sounding at all. All right, I'm causing a lot of attention. Am I? Maybe not. Maybe not. Let me actually bump up the sound a bit, maybe, for you guys. Oh, no, that's actually a bit loud. Bump it down. That's what I meant. My bad. Uh, let's keep looking around this city. What's this here? This looks like a vending machine. Maybe it was a vending machine. Maybe it wasn't. Oh, this is the cinema area. All right, so we should actually go in this direction, I believe so. I mean, we probably came from around here, but I want to kind of check out more of this city. There is a... Oh, okay, there's, there's like a tank. It looks like this tank broke into that wall. That looks pretty cool. I don't think there's going to be anything in there. Well, let's keep looking. There's a parking lot. I don't see any cars. Cars would have been nice to travel around here, but of course, we don't get the best of everything, so we just got to do what we got right now. But a landmine. I think that would disable any vehicle that may be approaching us, so that's pretty cool. So if we hear a car, we can just disable it with a landmine. Uh, let's keep looking. Let's see. This looks like a wall broken in here. Uh, let's actually check it out. Let's see what's, what's this going around here. Anything I see? Oh, I see a tunnel. This looks kind of cool. Let's check it out. We have a riot shield the tunnel here. Anything special going on around here? Probably not. We have some apartments that we could probably clear out. I feel like I've been in this area though. Uh, maybe I haven't. I'm not sure. Uh, maybe I'm just dreaming. It looks like some people use barricades to get on up here. I have one barricade that I can use. So that's that. And also, I believe that the uh, those storage containers that we placed last episode, I believe you can leave them in that area and other people can't access it or they can. However, if that's the case, the next time we know to leave our storage area in a good location because we do have our position and we can always find it. So that's always a good thing. Uh, let's keep looking around. I think, yeah, this is still New Haven. So uh, there could, oh, I see a vehicle. So we can actually get on out of here. Uh, if we do have some fuel, so that's always a good thing. Uh, let's get out of here. Bam. All right. Oh, we, maybe we, we're stuck. Maybe we're stuck here. Oh, that's a horn. Oh, that's cool. Oh, we almost just destroyed that car. Uh, let's keep driving. Let's see. Is there a way out of this city? 
Doesn't look like it. Can we go through this? Oh, we may be able to sneak around up. No, we can't. Okay, I don't even know how we got through that wall. Uh, let's keep. It looks like New Haven is really jam packed with trees growing randomly. This looks like there's no space. Another car, sub car. Oh, there we go. Um, all right, let's go off roading a bit. Let's go through these pathways and see if we can find anything around here. Um, I really doubt it though. Oh wait, I forgot to do something. Bam! There we go. Much better. All right, let's keep looking. Are we out of fuel? What's going on here? What are we? Are we stuck? How did that happen? We just wasted another fuel canister. Oh, that's not good. But I love this horn sound. <laughs> that's awesome. Just imagine passing by like a few survivors or a few walkers and just just beeping the horn. Like, what's up, man? Just you know, dropping off some pizzas, deliveries of all that good stuff in the post-apocalyptic world. Just imagine how good a business would be a pizza in a post-apocalyptic world. Dang, that that business would be booming. Um, all right, let's keep looking around. Doesn't look like there's any cities around here. This could be a long road towards any type of city. New Haven is a pretty big city, but there's a lot of places that we can check out on this server, which is really, really interesting, and I want to check as many of them as possible. Uh, so let me know in the comment sections what city or town we should check out in the future, and maybe we'll give that a shot. Uh, hopefully, it will be a cool place to check out, because I know I've we only been in New Haven once, and I think other places that we've seen in the last episode was, I'm not exactly sure of the name, but, uh, oh, there's a bridge. I'm tempted to take this bridge, guys. I think we're going to take this bridge. It looks really tempting. There could be like a residential area around here, maybe. Maybe I'm mistaken. I don't know. Uh, let's go this way around this hill and see if we can find anything. So far, it's, it's just a simple roadway. So I don't know where I'm driving. I do not have any maps by any chance to see where I'm going. We're kind of running out of fuel. It kind of feels like we're running out of fuel. Uh, but I don't. maybe we're not. We're going to take a shortcut. We're going to go off-road here a bit. All right, it doesn't look like anything around here. Hmm, maybe we hit an area that's like a dead zone. Uh, I don't know. It looks like this is a sandy area. Kind of looks at the edge of a coast, maybe. Maybe we're heading towards a beach of some sorts. Who knows? Who knows? Uh, let's see. Come on, there's got to be some more stuff around here. Oh, there we go. I see something. This looks like a factory tower of some sorts. Or a light. No, that's definitely a factory tower. So let's check this out. This looks kind of interesting. Um, the only issue is if we get out of the vehicle i don't think we can drive it much more uh so i would say i don't think that's the best thing to check out right now for us we could probably find some more things if we go down this road maybe cross my fingers because it's been a while now so hopefully hopefully that's the case hopefully that's the case all right so what i'm gonna do actually is i'm gonna keep driving and i'll see if i find a city anytime soon and we'll cut to that part see you guys in a second Alright guys, we're back and look what we found. We found some type of, looks like a military base by any chance. Looks like some military uh, base camp here for a bit and some more abandoned buildings. Now this place looks like it's been in the rough for a while now. So, oh, whoa, 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 my mouse just spazzed out. So, uh, let's see, what is this? Welcome to Port Echo. Is this Port? Yeah, this is Port Echo. So it looks like we hit Port Echo. I'll pop up the map again, circle it, and this is a military area. It's a military truck right here. Anything in here? Oh, some more arrows. We'll take that. All right, this is actually pretty cool. That truck is really awesome, but only thing is I don't have any more fuel canisters, so we cannot drive it unless we find some more fuel canisters, but we can always hold up here and see if we can find a base that we can hold off for the day. Oh, this is a stakeout gun. That looks pretty awesome. We'll, we'll just take it. It's a shotgun. I think shotguns are really OP. My, my opinion, I feel like any shotgun would be a dangerous shotgun. Looks like a head right there. Uh, so this looks like a really well-established military base by some sorts, but it looks very abandoned. So from what I can tell, this port has kind of fallen to the pieces here, kind of fallen down to the ground. I don't see much going on besides just a lot of rubble and just really abandoned buildings. So, oh, there's a chest here. I forgot, we really need to find water if we want to live. Uh, it's kind of spam, a uh, chain mill, uh, no, what is this? A chainsaw. Uh, this is a crowbar. We kind of need that, I guess. Black leather jacket, not going to be too useful for us right now. We can't break in. That looks barricaded pretty well. Um, but yeah, we're really kind of running low. We need some water for sure, guys. This is a big danger. We really need water. It's so difficult to find it, actually, now that I realize. Uh, man, that's going to be interesting. Hopefully, one of the kits that we have may have some water. Oh, a hammer. That looks intense. Uh, let's see. No, we don't need that. Oh, back off. I'm going to hit you with this hammer. Bam. There we go. Take you guys out. Oh, this hammer really kind of does the trick not really though not the most successful when it comes to hitting off a few walkers what is this here though 
I feel like I just go flying. Oh, there's another one. All right. The thing is, there's a good knockback on this. Let's go to the roof. Maybe we can find something on the roof here. Uh, looks like I see some type of building, some type of flag. Well, oh, wow. These guys are really preparing for this. Oh, my gosh. Do you guys see this? It's like a warfare section here. Tanks. There's like other type of boats that drop off people. The walls here are destroyed. So this place got hit really bad. That's, 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 uh worrying for us but i mean maybe there's not a lot of people around here oh my gosh this is a model 11 that's a legit shotgun this thing will cause danger to anyone in the way look at that oh we cannot have that gun right now let's see no primary gun we have to take these out because i forgot about that it can actually you know affect us when we need to take out some people so now i believe oh there we go wow there's actually a big knockback on that well that's intense if you guys enjoyed today's episode make sure you guys hit that like button we're coming to the end of today's episode um other than that guys i really enjoyed you know kind of checking out more of these places we're probably gonna oh zombie head we can put that on i heard and it does do camouflage helps out walkers to kind of see that hey this guy might need not might not be a person maybe he's a zombie like one of us so we'll keep it on for a few days but other than that guys i hope you enjoy everything and uh if you guys want to see more make sure you guys hit that like button and let's even go for 100 to 200 likes and more daisy will be on its way thanks guys so much for the support leave a comment down below about anything that you guys saw in today's video and i'll see you guys next time peace out and stay foxy